And hear me, I brought this. Can you look here? I brought this. <laughs> can, you, can you see? It's a serious matter. Tonight is a serious, is a night of a seriousness. So you must be, you must pay rapt attention to hear. You must pay rapt attention to hear and to know how to use this in your life. For you to understand how to use this, you need serious prayer. For you to understand what the enemy is using this to do in your life, you have to understand. You need a hearing ear to hear that. You need a seeing eyes to see that. You need a perceptive mind to conceive that, to perceive it. Hallelujah. So this thing, how many of you in the Zoom or on Facebook? I'm going to bring it back because many people are trying to connect. How many of you have ever seen this in your life? How many of you know this, those on Zoom? Do you know this? Can you look at this? Patrick, can you see this? If you know, you can see it. Wave your hand. Patrick, can you see this? Can you see what I carry? Can you see? Violet, can you see it? Anna, can you see what I carry in my hand? Rosemary Hugh, can you see it? Good. Justice, can you see this? Have you seen this before? Okay. Who can tell us what this is all about? What is this? Who, who knows the meaning? Patrick, can you see this? Wave your hand if you know you can see it. Okay. Now, who knows the meaning of this? Who can tell us the meaning of this? But you cannot even say that because first we need to ask, put the light. Then you can tell us. I want you to open your eyes, open your, open your lips and say, Father, I need a light. I want to see from now. I want to see beyond here. I need a light. I need the 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 light to see beyond here. Let me go ahead and ask the light. I'm putting light to you. You need to see. You need to hear. You have to perceive. Go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. Begin to say, I need the light. You can see the light shining. You can see the light. Can you see the light? How many of you can see the light on the Zoom on Facebook or YouTube? Can you see the light? You need the light to go forward. You need the light. When you don't have the light, you stumble. A, 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 a brighter light, a greater light to govern the day, and a lesser light to govern the night. The same brighter light is given to you during the day and during the night. Remember when the children of Israel left the land of Egypt, they used a, 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 um, a greater light to go during the day and a greater light to go during the night. They never used lesser light at, lesser light at night. Hallelujah. How many of you read that in the book of Exodus? He said they use, he gave them greater light during the day and greater light during the night. Hallelujah. And he said during the night, the sun could not, during the day, the sun should not smite them. And at night, no power stop them. So you need that light. Begin to ask for the light. Anywhere you are, begin to ask for that light. Begin to ask for that light. Father, I need the light. I need to see into the supernatural. I need the ear to understand, to hear your word, because faith comes by hearing and hearing the word. Oh, Holy Father, oh, Holy Father, grant me a seen eyes and grant me a hearing ear. This night I have come to you, this day I have come to you, this hour I have come to you. On this 14th day, oh Lord, seven is perfection. Today I have double. Therefore, my life shall be perfected double today. I need a Greater light during the day and greater light at night to move. I shall be awake while my eyes are open and while my eyes are closed. I shall be awake at all times. Because weeping may endure for the night, but joy coming in the morning. This is my morning. Oh Lord, I need your light. I need your light when I walk because the word says, whoever walketh in the light does not stumble. Oh Lord, I need the light to move. I need the light to shine. I need the light to move. I need the light. Chambers, go ahead and declare that. I need the light. I need the light, Lord. Grant me the light. Grant me the seeing eyes. Grant me the hearing ear, O oh Lord. Tonight is a night of change in my life. I need the shovel to move forward. 
I need to dig out every deep thing they buried, wherever they dip it, wherever they have done it. Oh, Lord, grant me that eyes. Grant me that ear. Grant me the ear to hear in the name of Jesus Christ. Thank you, Holy Spirit. For in Jesus Christ's mighty name we pray. And I hear you say, Amen. Now, this instrument is called shovel. It's called what? Shovel. What is shovel? Shovel is a flat instrument used to dig something to, to remove what is buried or to dig a grave. Most places when you dig a grave, especially in African country where traditional things are done, they use what? They use a shovel. It's only in a, in a, in, in, in a developed country that sometimes they use a, 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 a they use a, 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 um, a, 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 a front loader of TLB, hallelujah, to till the ground and pull it out and pull the ground. But most places, most of us, I can say most of us, if 90% of us, they use shovel to do that in our countries. They use shovel to dig out things. Hallelujah. How many of you know what shovel is used? Who have ever used shovel? Do we have anyone who use shovel here? Can you open your list from the table? Tell us, open for the person and let him tell us. Let him tell us. If you know you are wanting a change in your life, whatever that is buried against you, you want it to be dug out. Just where behind you. Who knows about shovel? Yes. So tell Shalom, us. man of God. Yes, yes I morning. use shovel. I use regular shovel at home. Good morning. I use to shovel regular at home to dig, or uh, to take some some something from the from the ground. Oh, I you use regularly. a shovel always. Yeah, yes. Where in Africa or in Europe or in America? In where? Europe, in Europe, in oh, Europe. Or even in Europe, you use shovel. Yes, 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 all the time. Always, okay, yes, that's yes, great. Yes. So yes. when you were in Africa, were you using the shovel? Yes, also I was using it in, in I was using shovel because I used to go to a builder site to help them. You used to go to a building site? Yeah, to help people. So they give me to, to bring them sand or to, to bring their mixed cement or whatever. So you so shovel to, to mix it. Yeah, yes. So an instrument used to mix certain substances, to mix yes. something together. Okay. Yes. Okay, good. Good. I want to know that. I want everyone to know that. An instrument to mix things. So what has the enemy mixed in your life? Do you know that? What is the instrument used to mix it? Now, I want to ask you, how many of us are at home in our house right now? How many of us are in our house? Are you in your house? If you're in your house, go into your kitchen. Get me, get me a spoon. Bring it out. Go into your kitchen quickly. Get me a spoon. People of God, I want to prove something to you. The word is deep. That is why the word is wicked. The word is full of iniquity. Okay, look your, look your spoon. Can you check your spoon? I didn't say a fork. Do you see a spoon? Can you check your spoon with the one I have? Does it look like, does it look the same? Does it look the same? I'm asking somebody who has a spoon. Patrick, does it look the same? Yes, it looks the same. It's the same? Yes, sir. What do you use spoon to do? What do you use spoon to do? To eat with. What do you eat with spoon? Food. Which food is that? Uh, normally something that is uh, could be pap or rice or... Okay, uh, so you eat it. So when you are using spoon to eat rice, what do you do? You dig into it and then you put it in your mouth. Okay, so which means you use the spoon to mix the rice, the, 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 the one that is the, 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 the soup touch and the one the soup did not touch. You use it to yes, mix. Sir. You yes, use it sir. to mix. Okay, yes, tonight you're going to use it to mix something. Oh, yes. <laughs> you, you, you have to use it to or mix what is mixed against you. <laughs> oh, thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. <laughs> okay. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Have everyone understand what I'm trying to demonstrate. This is deep prophetic 
revelation. This is a deep prophetic revelation. Yeah, I can see many people having the spoon. If you look at your spoon and look at what I'm having, you see they look the same. The same thing here. The same thing here. You see that? Okay. Even a sister have it. A sister is demonstrating, showing us the one she also have there. <laughs> and I believe she, she see that in Europe or she's in Africa. Okay, now, now look at it. Let me tell you what you have. What that thing you have is dangerous. Most of the witch doctors, most of the witch doctors, one of the instruments they use to do evil against people to mess their life is this shovel. This is what they use. And when they use this to do those things, you don't realize anytime you take food and put it in your mouth, you are eating what they mix. That's why they project it into food. They project it into everywhere. And they give you food at night. You don't know what you're eating. You think, you're, oh, my mother is giving me food at night. My uncle, hey, you know, that my auntie, that man I love is giving me food. No, it's not that man. They have mixed something and you use, begin to use the fork if you're going to use the spoon, they cannot, they can't give you fork. That's why Chinese are very clever. The Chinese, the Koreans, the, Jap the Japanese are very clever. Instead of using that, they use something else. They do it this way, even when they're eating rice. Because they know the danger and the evil they have used this thing to do. People from the Eastern world are dangerous. The Eastern world. The, because of that, when the Eastern world, when the Christians carry the gospel to the Eastern world, they reject them. They say, get back. We know what you're trying to do. And they have to dust their feet and go. And they establish their own kingdom. If you go to Japan, they use those two, two, two sticks. Why are they using stick to eat rice? Why are they using stick to eat uh, 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 uh. even meat, even fish? They use stick. And when you give them soup to drink, instead of using the spoon to drink the soup, they do what? They, use, they, they, they carry it on their plate and pour it in their mouth. <laughs> are you hearing me? Have you ever sat down to reason this? Can I hear you say deep revelation? So tonight's message must be titled deep revelation. And it's a message that we need to hear often. It's something that will open our eyes to understand what is going on in the spiritual realm. They use this to mix a lot of things against people's life. And when it's mixed, life becomes a mess. But tonight, the Lord will turn your mess to a message. He will turn your test to a testimony. In the name of Jesus Christ, you will undo whatever they have done and you will dig out whatever they have buried against you, no matter where they buried it. In the name of Jesus Christ. I am not telling you never to use, uh, don't use spoon anymore. You have to use it. But from today, when we, this, when we do demonstrate this, what we're going to demonstrate today, they will no longer use it against you. Even when they use it, it will not work. When they try to use it, it will no longer work because you're already, listen, anything that is revealed is no more a secret. Praise the Lord. It's no more a secret. So tonight, I want you to be very careful. And I want you to be very attentive. This is the reason why a lot of things are happening. This is the reason. The life is deep. The life is deep. When you go to China, or when you go to Korea, when you go to Japan, when you go to Laos, when you go to Cambodia, when you go to Vietnam, and when you arrive there, including Singapore, when you when they give you food, they will go and get a spoon and give you. And you tell them, but where is your own spoon? No, it's okay, we are good. Because when they capture you with a spoon, they finish you. And that is why whoever eats with the devil needs a long spoon. You see how long my, my fork is, my spoon is. You need a long spoon so that your hand will be outside. 
Any little thing, you ask them to go with a spoon because of what they have mixed in their life in, against themselves. Praise the Lord. I will give you scriptures that has to do with this. And they begin to dig out what is buried. What do you use to dig out a grave? You use the, you use the shovel to dig out, to dig a grave. When you want to bury something on the ground, some people, they use the, 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 the tilling to till the ground. They use the shovel to till. They use it to till, to mix the sand and begin to plant things. And when you want to plant, you open, you mix fertilizer and things, then you plant. Hallelujah. People of God, this is serious. This is serious. So for that reason, you have to take your life very serious. You have to take your life serious more than ever because those that are working against you, they meant business. But tonight, our God shall turn every evil they have done against you into foolishness in the mighty name of our Lord Jesus Christ. So you need the shovel of life to overcome the evil, to overdo what the, the evil they have done against you. Praise the Lord. That's why our Lord Jesus Christ came. He said, I come that you may understand, that you may have life. I am here to give you life. I am here to prove to you what you have to do. And when they ask him, sir, teach us how to pray. Look at what I'm wearing in my neck. He said, our father, when you pray, say, our father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. So the will of God as it is being in, that, in heaven is not done on earth. That's why the sun comes so that the same will of God that is done in the heaven shall be done here on earth. So tonight by the deep revelation and divine revelation of God, no power will dig anything against you. And whatever they have dug against you, that has been rooted away in the name of Jesus Christ. And for you to take a tree, you need to dig it from the root. If you cut a tree, it will grow again. If you cut a tree, it will grow again. But when you take it from the root, it will not grow. It will not grow. Hallelujah. So people of God, they use this to do a lot of evil. And you use this, use this to undo what they have done. Use this to undo what they have done. Many people in Europe, in other countries, they use this to dig even, even the snow. When the snow fill everywhere, they use this like in Europe, in America, in South America, in China, in Japan, they use the shovel. There's even some big ones. They use it to dig out there, to, to remove the shovel, they remove the, the snow. They use this to remove the snow from the ground. So this is used for many things. So when they mix this in the night and use it against one, then in the night, in the during the day when you are eating, you are mixing. They say whenever this one mix any food to eat, this which we have mixed, his food must turn to this, so that he begin to eat sand. You see that wickedness. But tonight, whoever wants you to eat sand, they will begin to eat sand. You will never eat sand in your life. You will triumph over them. God, my Father, will give you victory over them. In the name of Jesus Christ. Can I get him to that? So you have to take the life very serious. Life is deep. If you want to dig a hole, uh, dig a pit, you use the shovel to begin to dig the pit. Even to, even to dig a well. To dig a well, you need what? You need a shovel to dig a well. Praise the Lord. That very pit which Joseph was dumped in, uh, this was used for it. They use this for it. But Joseph said, you plan it for evil. My father have turned it to good. Because your will was not perfect, was not given to you by the father. And I have, I am, I have gone ahead of you to, to save you from destruction. Praise the Lord. So tonight, my God, my father have delivered you. And they will do that with their five fingers. They will do that with their what? With their five fingers. When they take the five finger, they hold it, they add another one in order to make it firm. So whatever they are doing, they try to affirm it 
So as soon as you use your hand and touch a spoon and mix anything, you begin to eat the rubbish they've done. That's why most people eat from the dustbin. Most people eat from the pit. Praise the Lord. I remember a young man that is drinking water from the toilet. He will eat, he will, that was delivered in synagogue. When you go and, 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 and excavate, excavate or whatever, then he uses his hand to pack it and eat. Because of the evil they have done against him. He left his family and everyone in Germany only to come to Africa begin to die. Eat shit. Drink the water of shit. Eat his own shit. Can you see the evil? So people of God, good morning. How many of you have guessed something today? Because we are moving into this thing. Say, Father, tonight, whatever they have used shovel to bury in my life, I use my hand, my five finger. I turn it into a shovel. If you have a spoon, turn that spoon into a shovel. If you don't have a spoon, turn your hand into a shovel. Say, I lift my hand and I receive the shovel of life. I receive a shovel of life. I hold a shovel of life in my hand. I give you a shovel of life. Receive it. Receive it. Receive it. Receive it. Receive it. Receive it. Stretch your hand and get it. Stretch your hand and collect it. Those of you that do not have, those on Facebook, those on YouTube, those on Zoom, get it, get it, get it, get it, get it, get it, get it. Everything they have buried against you, I've given you a shovel. Say, Father, on this 14th day, I dig out, I shovel out whatever is buried against me. Begin to dig it out. Everything they have mixed in your life, wherever they bury your birth destiny, wherever they bury your career, stand on your feet, begin to dig it. Whoever is digging does not kneel down, does not sit down. They stand up and dig. They have done it. So anywhere you stand, they begin to walk against you. Dig it out. I stand in the name of Jesus Christ. I'm digging out all the things they bury against our life against our ministry, against your marriage, against our finances, against our health, against our documents, against your future, against your life, against your children, against your grandchildren. Begin to dig it out. Anything they mix, any grief they've dug for you, dig out, open for them to fall. In the name of Jesus, remove everything that belongs to you that they bury in the womb of the earth. Begin to dig it out. 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 Begin to dig it out in the name of Jesus Christ. Go ahead, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. Continue to dig it. Continue to dig it. Continue to dig it. Continue to dig it out. Continue to dig it out. Anything they mix in your life that are miss your life, that are miss your children, dig it out. 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 Dig it out from right to left. From right to left, the right hand of God is power. Dig it out. 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 Go ahead and dig it out. Do it. Go ahead and dig it out. Dig it out. Everything they mix. Anywhere they bury their career, anywhere they bury their wedding ring, anywhere they bury their documents, anywhere they bury their success, dig it out, dig it out, dig it out. Every demonic pit, every demonic hole they've done for you, the enemy shall fall into it. Begin to dig it out. Begin to dig it, begin to dig it, begin to shovel it out. Shovel it out, shovel it out, shovel it out. Shovel out your blessing. Use the shovel of light to bring it out. Use the shovel of light, use the power of God, the power of Christ in the name of Jesus Christ. Shovel it out. Begin to shovel it. Begin to make sure what you're shoveling. My wealth, my success, my marriage, my wedding ring, my career, my future, my destiny. I shovel them out. I shovel them out. My prayer life, Shekinah Glory Ministry, Rafa TV, Sever Thy Soul, everything Sever Thy Soul. Yes, dig it out, dig it out, dig it out, dig out your destiny. Dig out your children, your grandchildren, your unborn children, your born children. Dig it out, dig it out, dig it out, dig it out. Anywhere they're buried, wherever I buried it, Dig out everything they have done. Go ahead, go ahead, go ahead, shovel it out. Shovel it out. Use the shovel of life. You are holding power and authority in your lips. Power and authority in your lips. Go ahead, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. People of God, begin to dig it out. Begin to dig it out. This is demonstration of power. Demonstration of power. Continue, continue, continue. Mention what you're digging out. Mention it, mention it, mention it, mention it. Mention it for something is happening. Something is happening. Something is happening. Something is happening in your village. Something is happening in that town. Something is happening in that city. Go ahead, dig it out. Shovel it out. Shovel it out. Shovel it out. Begin to shovel it. Make sure you're standing on your feet. Don't kneel down. Don't sit down. Begin to dig it. Begin to dig it. Begin to dig it. In the name of Jesus Christ, whatever they buried, whatever they buried, they already buried sadness, doubt, gossip, faithlessness, confusion, 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 conspiracy. Dig it out. 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 Begin to 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 dig it out. Go ahead. 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 Mention what you're digging out. Are you digging out your house? 
your cars, your documents, your finances, your wealth, whatever they mix against you. Anywhere they mix against you. Anything they mix against your life. Go ahead, dig it out. Dig it out. Is this spirit of drunkenness? Is it fornication? Is this envy? Is it jealous? Is it wickedness of the enemy from your father's side, from your mother's side? Go ahead, dig it out. Shovel it out. Shovel it out. Use the shovel of light to take it out. 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 Go ahead. 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 In Jesus Christ, mighty name, we pray. Hallelujah. I see victory. 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 Wave your hand. Wave your hand. Wave your hand. Acknowledge him. Acknowledge him. Acknowledge him. I see victory. I see victory in Africa. I see victory in Europe. I see victory in America. I see victory in Asia. I see victory in Australia. I see victory in every nation. Wherever our people are. Yes, 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 yes. Say, I have dug out. I have dug out this day. The 14th day. I have dug out. I have crossed over. I have done it. At midnight, the gate was open. At midnight, when prayer was made, I've entered midnight. Hallelujah. 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 Go ahead, 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 go ahead. Go ahead. Give him thanks. 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 Go ahead and give him thanks. Give him thanks. Give him thanks. Give him thanks. The shovel of life. You have shoveled out. You have taken out. You have taken out whatever they have done against your life. In the name of Jesus Christ. Thank you, Holy Spirit of God. Thank you, Holy Spirit of God. For in Jesus Christ, mighty name, we pray. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Hallelujah. No. People of God, check yourself. You can see that virtues has gone out of you. Something has happened. Something has happened. Everything they buried against you, no matter where they buried it, we have shoved it out. We have removed it. They will no longer harm you. Everything the Lord has turned it upside down. Remember when you shovel, when you dig, hallelujah, just watch me, when you dig it, you turn it the other way around. When you dig, you turn it upside down. Hallelujah. You take it, you turn it, anything they have turned upside down in your life, hallelujah, you have brought it out to the surface in the name of Jesus Christ. Hallelujah. 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 You, people of God, I know many people, those who have done evil against you, they are now saying, yo, who is this man that is revealing the deep things, the damages we have done? It's not a man, it's the creator of heaven and earth. It's even also the one that created them. Who gave us the deep revelation about this? Praise the Lord. So, every grave they have done Dug for you, that grave will swallow them. Wherever grave they bury what belongs to you, we have dug it out. And now, hear me. Remember, you turn upside down, whatever they have done, you have undone. You have undone it. Praise the Lord. And hear me this. Right now, I put here and I, I move it away. I take here. I'm not talking, talking, taking it upside down. I move it like this. I'm going to do that for you. Your life has to go forward. Your life has to go forward. Your career has to go forward. Your marriage has to go forward. Your destiny has to go forward. Your children's life has to go forward. In the name of Jesus Christ. Every evil they have done against you have been revised back to them, back to sender. In the name of Jesus Christ. Anyone that will from this day make a mistake of digging any pit for you, plotting any evil to you, they have buried themselves. Their generation will be wiped out of the earth. Hallelujah. So people of God, I want to start to congratulate you. I want to congratulate you. Then I will now take out every other thing. And I want you to begin to say, Amen. Father, I come to you. As your prophet, as your oracle. These ones have come today to witness great deliverance. For your word said, Great deliverance give it to his people according to Psalm 18, verse number 50. To David and to his seeds, O Holy Father, I have come today in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ to declare that all the evil the enemy might have done against my people, Father, their life has to go forward. Everyone, their life was turned upside down. Father, I come. I dig out the remaining one and I remove it. I dig it out. I remove it. 
and I throw it away. They will no longer have power over them. I take it in the name of the Father. I throw it in the name of the Son. I take it in the name of the Son. I throw it out. I take it the Holy Trinity, and I move out. Your life has to move forward. 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 Your life, they have turned upside down. We move forward from today in the name of Jesus Christ. Your marriage must move forward. Your children's life must move forward. Your career must move forward. Your future must move forward. Your document must be released. Your property must be released. Your wedding ring has been moved forward. Everything about you with the enemy turned upside down. Today, I come with the shovel of life and I pull out and I release you forward. I release our ministry. I release Shekana Gloucester Ministry. I release LCP. I release our Zoom. I release Rafa TV. I release your company. I release your ministry. I release your children. I release you must go forward. We must go forward. You must go forward in the name of Jesus Christ. In the blood of Jesus Christ, your life must go forward. Your marriage must go forward. Your career must go forward in the name of Jesus Christ. Thank you, Father. Water goes forward. Water flows from on top. You must go from on top. You are the head, you are not the tail. You are the house built on top of the hill. You can never be hidden. Anything that I used to cover you, I dig it out. I destroy that grave of that growth of death, that growth of poverty, that sickness and rejection in your life, that barrenness, that stagnation, I move it away from you. You are delivered. You are set free. You are liberated. Your children are liberated. Your generation are liberated. On this 15th day that you have entered, beginning from 14th day, your life must go forward. I, Exodus 14, 14 said, and he said, I will fight for you and you hold your peace. I will fight the battle for you and I will give you peace. From this day you shall have peace. In your marriage you shall have peace. In your career you shall have peace. In your destiny you shall have peace. In your prayer life you shall have peace. In our ministry we shall have peace. In the name of Jesus Christ. In the blood of Jesus Christ. Can I hear you say hallelujah? Say victory, 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 victory. In the name of Jesus Christ. Go ahead and appreciate him. Go ahead, I appreciate him, I appreciate him, I appreciate him, I appreciate him for it is done. I appreciate him, I appreciate him, I appreciate him, I appreciate him. I appreciate him, I appreciate him, I appreciate him. I appreciate him, I appreciate him, I appreciate him. Go ahead, begin to appreciate him. Give him thanks, he's a great God. Give him thanks. I appreciate him for your life must go forward. Your career must go forward. Your future must go forward. Your destiny must go forward. In the name of Jesus Christ, say forward ever in my life. Backward never. Say I am the head. I am not the tell. Say, I'm above only. In the name of Jesus Christ. Say, my eyes is open. I shall see into the supernatural. My ears are open. I shall hear from the Father. My heart is open. I'm connected to Christ. Connected to the Holy Trinity. In the name of Jesus Christ. Say, thank you, Father, for deep revelation. Thank you for shoveling out, for using the shovel of life to realign my life to your word, to realign my life to your faith, to realign my life to your spirit. In the name of Jesus Christ. Say, thank you, Father. Thank you, Son. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Go ahead, begin to thank Him. 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 In the North, thank Him. In the East, thank Him. In the West, thank Him. As you go around, you're gonna do the work of God. As you go around, you're gonna preach the gospel. Your life will never be upside down. Your life shall go forward in the name of Jesus Christ. For in Jesus Christ, mighty name, we pray. I declare once again, you are blessed. Your name is blessed. You are favored. You are favored. You are elevated. You are promoted. In the name of Jesus Christ. In the blood of Jesus Christ. Every dark thing done against you. My God have cleansed it. He have cleansed it. Whatever they plan for evil on you, my God have turned it to blessing. You have the Lord have sent you. We have sent you above. I mean, I mean, I mean, ahead of them. Just as the Father sent. St. John the Baptist, ahead of our Lord Jesus Christ. My Father has sent you ahead of everything. You have gone to prepare a way, and you will enjoy it. They will never stop you on the way. They will never stop you. They will never stop you. You are unstoppable. There is a spirit in your feet. There is a spirit in your feet to overtake even those who began before you. Anything you eat in your mouth will never harm you. It will never destroy you. Whatever you eat will never destroy you. For the Bible said, not what goes into man destroys man, but what comes out of him. And from this day, what comes out of you can never destroy you. In the name of Jesus Christ. In the blood of Jesus Christ. Thank you, Father. Your light will shine continually. Your light will shine continually. Your life will shine continually. Your life will continue to go forward. Your ability must go forward. Your prayer life forward. Your career forward. In the name of Jesus Christ. Woo! Glory. Glory. I appreciate him. I appreciate him. I appreciate him. I appreciate him. I appreciate him for that evil load is off your neck. 
is off your shoulder. That yoke is broken on your, on, on your neck. That yoke on your neck is broken. The burden are off your shoulder. The dead are off your shoulder. Poverty is off you. Stagnation is off you. In the name of Jesus Christ. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Give him thanks. 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 You are healed. You are delivered. You are liberated. In the name of Jesus Christ. In the blood of Jesus Christ. The boat of those that are seeking to destroy you have capsized. Their boat have been capsized. They can never fly over your house. They can never fly over your property. They can never fly over your belonging. You are set free. You are liberated. You are liberated. You are liberated. We are liberated. We are set free. We are free in the name of Jesus Christ. For in Jesus Christ, mighty name, we pray. Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. Begin to cover yourself with the blood of Jesus Christ. Go ahead and cover yourself. Cover yourself. Cover your family. Cover yourself. Cover yourself. Cover your finances. Cover everything that belongs to you. Go ahead and cover them. Go ahead and cover them. Go ahead and cover them. Begin to cover them. Begin to cover our prayer with the blood of Jesus Christ. Go ahead. Cover our prayer. Cover our prayer. Cover our prayer. Go ahead. Begin to cover our prayer. Cover this meeting. Cover this meeting. Cover this meeting. Continue to cover. Continue to cover. Continue to cover. Continue to cover. 